is Toby and I play guitar and do vocals in the band Leatherhead. We first started playing under this name in around 2016. I'd played in a few bands before but this was sort of the first attempt at writing songs. Uh, it was initially just me and Josh, our saxophone player, and we really couldn't, uh, couldn't really play our instruments at first and it took us a long time to get it together. But it was probably when we moved to London in 2018 was when we actually started taking it um, more seriously and solidified the lineup and felt a bit more comfortable calling ourselves a band. We have a diverse array of influences as a band, but um, as a guitarist I take a lot of influence from musicians like Fred Frith and Bill Orcutt, um, the two guitarists from Palm. I guess just guitarists who are doing something like kind of different um, pushing it in a weird direction. Uh, that stuff has always interested me. I know that Josh often cites Ted Milton from Blur and John Lurie as big influences on his sax playing. We started playing with the poet and playwright Zia Ahmed after we'd booked him for a Solidarity Tapes event. He showed up and asked if anyone wanted to play with him and I sort of jumped at the opportunity. We've been fans of his work with the jazz drama Sarati Kawar for a long time. And uh, yeah, since that uh, show, we've been performing together um, relatively regularly, whether it's him guesting on a Leatherhead song or us creating like a sort of improvised soundscape for his poetry. Our recent Welded EP was sort of like a, um, an exercise in trying to write something a bit more longer form. We'd only done uh, sort of singles before or like a live record that was basically just like a, a recorded set. Um, but yeah, I think we learned a lot from trying to uh, make something more longer form and like working out how to make something flow. We are also part of a collective called Solidarity Tapes that uh, curates gigs and fundraisers and workshops for various causes, all with the intent to highlight the connections between uh, politics, activism and music. Music can be escapist, but it can also be uh, a tool for change, like a sort of grounding wire to the world and a means of collect connecting with people. And in that sense, like music and activism are linked in like a mobilizing and motivating way. The sense of togetherness you can feel at a gig watching music you love is similar to the feeling of being at a protest or an action. It's about getting uh, people in a room together and reminding each other of the power we have and using every opportunity, every platform, no matter how big or small, to say something. Oh God, we'll make it.